motherfuckers. I don't know. I'm actually just talking to myself, so. <laughs> uh, nah, so. On my way to work. Not. Not as late as I usually be. to talk about how I fucked up recently. Um, I went to a bar and a girl actually hit on me, which is rare. Girls usually don't do that, so obviously she was a thought. She looked pretty good too. It's white. And um, she called me beautiful. I didn't go get her number. But my friend went out to go get her number for me. And yeah, she he gave her my number and she never hit me back up. Which is totally my fault. I should have done something about it. I should have like not not have been a bitch. He actually did something. I mean, I think the old me would have done something. Like this new me is just like I just got so many L's and everything like that. So many times like fucking up. It's just like, I don't know. It's just kind of like hard to come back from that. I don't know. Like all the relationships are trying to get into like I fuck it up. So I don't know what it is. So I was just like, I don't know. Anyway, I didn't do anything about it. She never called me. She never texted me. So that was an opportunity right there, you know. And I let so many opportunities pass by me. Like God keeps giving me chance after chance after chance after chance after chance. I mean, not even just with women, but with like job opportunities, life opportunities, and I just let them slip by. Like ah, oh, something else will come by. You know what I'm saying? There's only so many opportunities he could get me, you know. I don't know what the next opportunity is going to be, you know. But I'm just so, like, broken and, like, damaged and shit like that. I need to, I don't know, I need to get with, like, an ugly girl. I don't fucking know, man. Boost my confidence. That's it. I have, like, low confidence and shit. If I had higher confidence, I would have a better job. Um, just better outlook at life. Just better, just better life in general. Honestly, that's why I keep taking these low-paying jobs because, like, I don't feel like I'm up to. same time I am you know like I was pretty I was pretty good at rotor rooter you know like I wasn't lazy I am lazy but I think everybody's like a little bit lazy and you know I just it's just like the lack of confidence I guess man I could have been like really good at my last job, Rotor Rooter, but like, you know, like the lack of confidence and everything, not, not wanting to take a lead role and be a lead, you know, because I didn't think I was up to it. I don't know how to gain confidence either. Keep saying one day it's going to hit me. Getting a little bit impatient. Maybe one day it might hit me. I don't know. Um, I know I gotta start doing things a little bit differently to prosper and shit like that. I get I get distracted too easily. 
I need to focus on something, focus on me. Like, like I said before, I do want a girlfriend and everything like that. I do want something to be fucking, you know, but at the same time, I don't want to jerk off either, but at the same time, like, that's going to be a huge distraction. That's going to, I know that's going to, like, stop me from, like, getting where I want to be, a goal and everything like that. Or is that just an excuse? I don't fucking know. tell you one thing I need to do is like keep posting videos every fucking day just flood YouTube with fucking me talking about bullshit you know but what else was I gonna say um Talked about opportunities, I fucked up. Trying to think. I mean, there's always something to talk about, I just can't think of anything right now. Like, I know as soon as I cut off the video, I'll think of something to talk about, something to say. I want to say, oh, it's a nice day. I say that all the time. It's a nice day. But it is a nice day. It's pretty cold out, though. It's, like, windy and shit. Oh, so I bought some, like, $300 sneakers. I don't know if that was, like, the right thing to do. Like, in my current situation, I'm not making a lot of money. Um, but I really wanted those sneakers, though. Like, I don't know. Maybe I could have spent my money a little uh, more wisely. You know what I'm saying? Like, maybe you even bought some motorcycle gear, which is like probably would be well better spent. But those sneakers did look fresh, man. Another thing is like for me to spend money. I mean, I had to start making money, man, because this job is not cutting it. Like, I fucking just made like 900 fucking 42 dollars for a two week paycheck, and that ain't that ain't fucking cutting it, man. It's just not, man. I need to make $1,000 a week, man. I can't be like, making less than $500 a week, man. That's some... That's bogus, man. I might as well just go back to Rotor Rooter. I don't want to do that, though. But I still have the feeling in me, like, I'm going to I'm gonna make something of myself, man. Like, it's just, it's a little fire left. It's a little fire left that just won't go out. And that's all you need, man. You can't, you can't quit can't quit at anything because once you quit it's over i'm not ready to hang it up yet i'm 31 years old i'm an old ass fucking man but i ain't that old i ain't that old i fucking look 20 something so that's a good thing I'll just pretend i'm 20 something you know but i gotta make something out of myself soon because this shit getting tiring man like i'm fucking damaging my body my, my body's like dude i can't take anymore yo all your life you've been working fucking these fucking labor ass, labor intensive jobs, being out in the elements and shit like that, being cold, being hot, being in shit, being in dust. Um, driving, sitting down all day, back hurting. I need a fucking massage. I need to go to one of those Asian massage parlors, man. But, yeah, I think I'm going to end the video right here. I will definitely post this on YouTube when I get home. Yeah, I'll just keep going from there. Just post every fucking day. I'll talk about bullshit. I'll just talk about anything that comes to my mind. And we'll just go from there.